What do you guys think of my kitty cat? Do you like him? Do you think he's cute? Because he loves you guys. What's good, London? Today we're doing something very different. We, we are, are in the West. West! We never go West, but today we're in the West. We're about to get our sugar game on at Dominique and South Bakery because it's so on hype right now. Everybody talking about it. AKA Sugar Raj, let's go! One sugar rush, please. Is there actually something called sugar rush? No. All right. Because yeah. <laughs> that's what we want. Can we get one cronut, one of the DKs, one Banafi paella? Is there anything the else? Chocolate here? chip cookie oh, shot. Oh, the chocolate chip cookie shot. Let's make it two. Can we also get a, a matcha latte? That should be enough for a heart attack. Is you excited? Oh my god, I haven't eaten all day. I am actually a little hangry. I think you have noticed it. See what's gonna happen in about three minutes is we're gonna get super high on sugar. Without having had any sort of food, so that means yes, it's gonna go ah! Oh my god, I'm excited about this. Okay, why don't we start the day with a shot? Oh my god, there's like uh, chocolate sauce on the inside. Yeah, I think because it's a chocolate cookie, that they've turned into a shot and then they pour vanilla milk into it. Oh man, that vanilla milk is so good. And then you just eat the cookie around it? Yeah. Ooh. The cookie is unbelievable. This is a cronut, guys. It was invented by Dominic until it's a mixture of a donut, that's why it looks like a donut, and a croissant. As you can see, it's very fluffy and airy, like a croissant. Okay, he just, <laughs> Jens is going ham on this cronut. Oh my god. That smile on his face, check that smile. Man, this is actually banging. One thing I gotta say is I think you ate it wrong. You ripped it and you made it look a lot like really weird. I think you need to eat it it's like still a proper, delicious you though. Eat it like a proper donut. Yeah, yours looks better though. And you gotta respect it. Respect. Throw some respect on that cronut. It's so good. It shouldn't be allowed. It's unreal. Let us present you with the DKA, which is basically croissant dough, caramelized on the outside, but fluffy on the inside. What does it taste like, Goldilocks? Cookie, like a plain cookie back in the days. Caramelized on the outside, flaky on the inside. Super crunchy and sugary. Imagine taking a croissant, throwing it in a deep fryer. And you can taste the caramel, which gives it a sweet kick. Super fluffy and warm and soft on the inside. Delicious. Really good. I hope you're still hungry because we're now moving on to dish three. Upside down banafi paella. Hit it. What's good, Jens? My whole life is good right now. Oh. Shut up. <laughs> As you can see, they haven't mashed up the banana. It's, and they have caramelized it in the paella pan. The crumble at the bottom. And then banoffee cream. I think it's the caramelized bananas that bring this dish out. Insane. Try it, please. I've never had a banoffee pie like this. This is something I would definitely again you can only get this dish in London you can't get this in New York City so for all you New Yorkers out there you need to get yourself a flight over here and try it because banana pie is 10 out of 10 bang Dominique I'm done thank you Dominique I salute to you would I say the best dessert I've had in London it's in the top three one place that can mess with this place is Koba Oh, uh, Those milk crabs? Shh, leave it. Alright, I think I'm done, man. Alright, guys, that's it. We can't even talk right now. No more outro. Peace out. Woo. So full. So full. I am on a crazy sugar high. My heart is pounding. Same here. Delicious. My favorite was the Corona. What was your favorite? Uh, probably the upside down Banafi paella. Ridiculously good. The one thing that we will say, uh, the music is a little off, but it doesn't matter because they're known for their food and the food is ridiculous. So good. Dominic Ansel, 
in Victoria is definitely what's good.